We dropped it. What's good, fellas? What's good, Titan Nation? How we feeling, fellas? Woo! How we doing, fellas? How we doing? Tighten up. Tighten up, fellas. Let's go, man. We got round two. Round two of possibly three. We will see. <laughs> I appreciate everybody, man. I appreciate everybody. It's crazy because it's like, Everybody was like, what the fuck? Like, he's live early. He's like, what the fuck? He's going live again? Like, everybody thought I was playing, like, April Fool's tricks or something. I'm like, nah, bro, it's April, but it ain't no Fool's trick. Uh, this is cool. This is cool. The, um, you know, the rumors right now are going around the Tennessee, uh, you know, universe, if you will, is, uh, you know, Malik Neighbors is a real possibility. I know we talked about it a lot uh, in the previous show while we were driving around and being crazy, but I would like to know what you guys truly think about all this. I really would. I would really like to know what you guys think about, you know, what's happening with this football team. Um, you know, all the rumors floating around with, with uh, all the drafted players that, you know, the Titans are being linked to and everything like that. It's, it's, it's beautiful, man. It's, it's, I'm just, I'm just happy to be a part of this team, bro. And everyone that says, Oh, he's not, what the hell is he talking about? Like, how could you be a part? Just, like, for real, man, it's crazy, bro. Like, it's just, it makes no sense how some people think, bro. I appreciate everybody for being here, man. Seriously. Seriously, man, I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys hit that like button, comment, subscribe, do all that crazy stuff. You you guys know what's up. How are you guys feeling? Who do you guys want to draft, man? It's crazy going on. So much craziness today. Yes, sir. Let's see. Um, I'm going to try to. Uh, what's going on? Is that Billy? What up, bro? It's been a fucking minute. It's been a fucking minute. How's it going, bro? Same bullshit. Can you hear me good or no? I can hear. Can we? All, can you guys all hear? Can you hear? Can you Let's hear buddy? fucking get it. Give me one second. Let me turn the slide on. Hold on. Hey, you're good, man. We're chilling, man. This is crazy. <laughs> hey, hey how, do you, how you feeling about Malik Neighbors, bro? Is that somebody you interested in? Nah, I want y'all out, bro. Real shit, I want y'all out. That all line needs to be an all line again. You want Joe Alt? That's what you said. You said that I you I you said it so fast. I thought you were saying a new player. I was like, who? <laughs> John? I want Alt. I want Alt, bro. Hey, Michael, you can come up in here too. Michael, you can come up in here too if you want, big dog. Uh, yeah, Joe Alt would be great, bro. We need we need blocking. We need fucking blocking. Can't block. Shit, we need a we need a Taylor <laughs> Lewan two point bro. We need somebody oh, that's man. gonna be like he's Taylor si Wan. He's, he's similar to what was Taylor Wan was what six seven, I think. I don't know, he's like six six, six five. But you may be no, right. He was bigger. He had to have been bigger, dude. He's a big ass dude. You may be right. You may be right. Yeah, I don't know, man. That's a big ass dude. He said, "How do I join? You just jo join the um, go to the Discord. Go to the Discord on the mod, on the mod in the Discord, bro. Check it out." Come on, get come on, mods, get in here, bro. Let's let's have some fun, bro. Let's have some fun today. Bro, it's gonna be a great fucking day today. <laughs> oh man, hey, the, the rumors though on Malik Neighbors is crazy, huh? Like of the high maintenance shit. What do you think? Does that even matter? Like to that's you, does any, that that's in look, hold on. That's any player though. That's that could be anyone at any time of the fucking day. Shit. That could be fucking Caleb Williams leaving LA to go to wherever the fuck he goes. That LA mindset's gonna follow you everywhere you fucking go. Is that is that where he's from? No, he played for USC though, bro. Come on, now. Yeah, um, he played. He played in LA for what two years? Yeah. That mindset of where you play at is gonna go with you. That party lifestyle, it's gonna Wait, who follow you. Who, who are you talking about? Caleb Williams, quarterback USC. No, but why are you talking about? I'm confused. Why are you talking about? Caleb I'm just Williams? saying. I'm just saying in general, though. No matter where a player goes, that mindset is going to go with you. You can't detect or you can't determine how a player is going to be until they're on your fucking team. Oh, uh, you know, because you're, you're talking about high maintenance and all that, and how everyone thinks no, it's, it's a bad yeah, yeah. fucking thing. You can't yeah. determine how someone's going to act until they do it. Well, Caleb Williams over there crying like a little baby back bitch. <laughs> mom, that help is us. true. Mom, help. That, hug that me, is mom. true. That hug is me. Help bro, me. I was, bro, I don't want to talk about that. I was working that game, bro. I don't want to talk about oh, that. Oh, man. He's, he's a good player, bro, but he'd be showing some, oh, trust. some bitch, some bitch, like, like antics. And, and you know, like, it's like, 
You can't be, you got to show, is that a, do you want to see your leader hugging up on mom on the sideline, bro? That's but crazy he, bro, to me. Look, bro, he, he had it made. Where the fuck did he come from? What school was that? Before he went to SC? Uh, uh, what, uh, was it, was it in Oklahoma? Yeah. Him and the head coach. When you go from a different a team like that to a high profile team that has 135 national championships, come on, man. People are gonna fuck up your career like that. I want to say fuck up your career, but yeah. But come on, guys. We got 41 fucking people watching with eight likes. Like that fucking shit up. <laughs> it, bro, it's, it's like. This is probably like good old days, bro. When we first started off and shit, dude. It's just it's just funny how far how far you know how far it's come and 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 how entertaining <laughs> it is now. Like it's funny people be treating this shit like a job, and we just having fun, bro. <laughs> we, just, you got we, just, people, we just you got you got people changing shit up like we change shit up and all that. But yeah, it's like a mirror sometimes, but it's all good. But at least we show credit when it's fucking due. Fuck That's yeah, bro. Hey, shout out to everybody, bro. All the, all the, I don't know if there's anybody else trying to join. I'm not familiar with the uh, whole it'll, thing. It'll bring you straight in. So, hey, mods, in that mod chat, that first link he posted, oh, to bring hit that link. Is. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, I, I ain't never, you. we ain't really, met, we ain't really use it like that much. Pause. So, it's like, nah. I'm, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm trying to figure that out. But yeah, it's all good. It, it's cool. Cause I want to, I want to be able to get you guys in here, like, like, and, and, and talk every, like, if you guys want to. It doesn't oh, really sure. matter. It doesn't really matter. Like I said, we go live all the time, so why not just fucking shoot the shit with everybody? How's everybody doing in the chat, first of all, bro? For all the people wondering who who I'm talking to, that's Billy Scott. He's the general of the channel. He shows everybody. He, he lets everybody know bro, what's up. I'm a nobody, for, bro. Yeah, he's some I'm a nobody. He's, he's just some old-ass Titans. <laughs> Living the best city you can fucking live in, bro. Uh, you got you, you got Hey, you got hey Billy. Let them know about them California. Not that we we a new type of California Titans fan. <laughs> bro, we are bro, we are a fucking different breed, bro. Oh, <laughs> hey, you ready California to go to that? Titans. Hey, you ready to go? To that, you ready to go to that Charger game, huh? I already told you, bro. You let uh, me know, bro. I already got a connection. Yeah, I know Titan South gonna be there too. There's a few people that's gonna be there too. Oh, of course, get, I, already, get, I already told Titan. Yeah, look, bro. Yeah, we gotta get look, a, we gotta we gotta get a group picture, bro. That'd be fire. I already told you, bro. Hey, go by that lake right there. Take a picture by the lake, bro. Take over that shit. That's very clean. Hey, remember, bro. Saying. Come in your trap. Take over your trap. All I gotta say. <laughs> hey, we, come we beat in the Rams. Trap. We beat the Rams. Let's go beat the Chargers and finish there we it go. off, baby. And then bro, the that, hey, that Ram, hey, that Rams game. Oh my fucking god. Damn, that shit was crack. Hey, motherfuckers to the left, motherfuckers to the right behind us. Do, 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 hey, do, do, do. When that game first started and the Titans had a had a rough first drive, they're talking all this shit. Of Billy's course. like, it just and he's like, y'all, dude, it just started. What the fuck? Next Look thing up. you know, Kevin Byron. Look up. <laughs> Look up. Look up. Bro, with that Billy's fire. Like, that's like, hey. Billy's like, what's the score now? <laughs> hey, that fire, hey, that fire touchdown, bro. Bro, with one once that happens. They shut the fuck up. They shut hey, the fuck hey, that, up. Hey, that 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 was it, bro. That was like taking the horse out back. When like Billy's saying, when Bayard got that interception, uh, he ran right in front of us where we were at. That was so dope. Like like the Rams fans were flatlined after that. That that was that was it. That was the play where the Rams were dead. You know what I mean? That's when the Titans the Titans said, "That's it, man." And it was cool. A lot of people don't even know that was Adrian Peterson's first game with the Titans. Yeah. We, we hey, were there. he had a oh, he had a okay game, bro. We were I know, I remember that day exactly. Uh -huh. The week before, yep. Henry got hurt. We got the news that he's gonna be out for like what five to six weeks. You know, we're both saying, bro, uh, it's gonna be a fuck you game, kind of like we. I had no faith, real shit. I had no faith. It just sucked that we missed. It just sucked that we missed Henry because of the injury. You know, what I mean? that that was that was terrible. But I mean, we still got to see so much. Like we got to see the, uh, of course. the you know, the Tannehill finger roll. That was pretty cool on that on that, that fourth and, the fourth and inches or whatever it was on the bootleg. That was so clean, man. And you know, Julio Jones did some good, and and there, it was pretty cool. We saw some cool shit happen, man. We won. That's the most important thing. We won. So that was that, that was pretty. I wasn't sick. expecting to win though, bro. But a night game in L.A. Under the stars, bro. Come on now, dude. Dude, that shit was. I know that was a night game. That's what was crazy. I, I wonder I what was, this I, one's gonna be. 
Uh, you never know, though. Jim Harbaugh and all that? You never know. Or John Harbaugh, what the fuck his name is? With him coming in, bro, I might bring in a good few night games. Hopefully, ours is a night game. I want a night game. I know you don't, but I want a night game. You want the night game specifically? Hell yeah, bro. I love yeah, night bro. games. I, love night. I want an earlier game. I want that shit to be like super Fuck yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. How's everybody doing in the chat, man? You guys got any questions? How are we feeling about the draft, man? The Tennessee Titans, uh, you know, we got a lot to look forward to right now. We're sitting there with the seventh pick. Lots of teams in front of us need quarterbacks. And again, we've been talking about this for a long time. It's like we have uh, and because we already have our quarterback, we're sitting there in a good position. Um, I'm really hoping, obviously, that Marvin Harrison Jr., Malik Neighbors or Joe Alt is there. If they're not there and the Vikings haven't traded up yet. Billy, how are you feeling about that? Are you willing to trade number seven for 11 and 23? Well, again, if there's somebody there that we fucking need, if you're going to trade back, I need extra picks. I want both of your first rounds. I want a third round. And you can have it. If you're not... I mean, I would love to get as much as we can, for sure. Of, of course, no matter what. Uh, and, we got to we gotta treat these people how we treated the Rams back in 2016 and got 30,000 picks for one pick, kind of like. Dude, that was crazy, bro. <laughs> that was crazy. Yeah, we got we got we got to make sure. Um, let's say let's all right. Let's just say we do that. We, we won't even mention the third. Let's just uh, because let's not talk about who would draft with that. That's impossible to determine. But of let's course, just, it's let's, too let's far in advance. Yeah, let's say we did get those those two picks and the third uh, from the Vikings. <clears throat> who at a, is there anybody at eleven and and twenty three that you'd be like, okay, this is what we should do or nah. positions? Like, I think I think I mean at eleven, you know, Olu should be there if we really want to go there. <laughs> I don't want him though. I don't, I don't trust him. I don't either. I'm not either. Uh, JC Latham is will be there. Um, that'd be a big. He's huge. Uh, good blocker. I know Rome should be there, but we'll see. Um, I don't want him. <laughs> uh, the, again, again, there could be a few. A few. Is there any? What do you think? Dallas Turner, possibly. What do you think? I just want. Look, if it's not old, if it's not fucking, I want Marvin Harrison. That's all I want. But I already know what Arizona's gonna take him. The Chargers might take know. him. Maybe, uh, yeah. Pro, um, Arizona Giants and and Chargers are our biggest threats to taking receivers. Exactly, exactly. You know what I'm saying? And and and, and with um, Arizona wanting to trade back, I heard. Yeah, but I hope still, that happens. And 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 if the Vi and if they trade back with the Vikings, let's say, then that helps us too. Of so, course, no doubt. There's there's so many ways to look at it to where it could be beneficial for sure. Titan South says Thursday night game would be lit. That would be pretty cool. I, could I, fuck I with would that. like a Thursday night game, but I would like a Monday night even better. Yeah, dude, that'd be insane. Big Dog says <laughs> watch Ridley burn Christian Fulton for a touchdown. I hope that happens. I will go nuts. But if it's a Monday night game, bro, those tickets are going to be a lot. Oh, I know. They're going to be money, bro. Ollie says, who would you rather have, neighbors or Bowers? Uh, neighbors, um, neighbors. Just because but we're if, like we're, we're like banking on fucking Chig and Wiley need to do their job. That's just what it's gonna come down to. Just do your job. But if we do go to eleven, Bowers might be there. That's true. Uh, Big Dog says paired neighbor. Uh, what do you say? He says paired neighbors up with Ridley and Deha. That would be dangerous, bro. Titan Kong says Fuaga and Turner. That could be interesting. Um, Titan fan says Bowers at 11. If Jets don't take him, having an all star tight end again, I, that's that's getting value there. If you if you trade back and you get that extra pick, take, take Bowers if you need to. Uh, let's see. Juan G says Arizona's trying to get Malik Neighbors, bro. I mean, we'll see. Like I said, we don't know. There's rumors on all this, so that's what's so, that's what's so crazy about this. We just don't know. We don't know. Squad says there's definitely going to be at least one trade up in the top six. That's I, I just think something. <laughs> I feel nah. like something big's coming. You think everyone's gonna sit there no trades? The only team I see trading up is Minnesota. But because you, well, how that, this that's draft a, that's a big ass trade. But if in this draft, everyone there's a lot of elite players in the draft. So there's enough to pass around to everybody. So everybody's gonna be charging a lot to get that 
big name player on their team. So the more spots you want to move up, the more that draft capital is going to cost you in the long run. Hey, Maz, hit that link. Maz, let's, let's see if we can get more people in here and see how it looks. Come on, Maz, just hit that shit. Let's get it going. Let's have some fun. Let me see. Um, and pause for the fucking cause, bro. We got 30 people watching with 11 likes. Like yeah, that let's, get it going, bro. let's get it going. Let's get it going. He says, Titans News with Cam says, your sunglasses look like a visor without a helmet. That is so cool. <laughs> there we go. We finally get some, some good looks on that. Juan G says, neighbors, after watching his highlights, he got some weaknesses too, but we're going to see. All I see is a dude running by everybody. That's all I see. Yeah, but let's just hope whoever we get doesn't turn into Isaiah Wilson 2.0. Is that even possible? That's crazy, bro. Like, what's <laughs> you never possible? fucking know. You never fucking know. <laughs> Let's hope that Bruh. shit don't happen. That'll be a miserable time, bro. Oh my Bruh, God. that man got caught up every fucking week, basically. Every week, his name was in the fucking news. <clears throat> what a bum. Uh, Sportstacular says, do you think the Titans having another visit with neighbors over alt means they're going a different direction? I've been saying that they're probably going to go receiver over them anyway because over blocking first anyway because look at Brian Callahan it was just in that situation when the Bengals took uh, Jamar Chase and then they took the, the left tackle or whatever in, in the second round and they they, they used the, uh, the other later picks for uh, drafting as well as the free agency to build – um, as good as they possibly could at that point. We all, we've all seen what Jamar Chase can do. Like, that guy is a fucking beast. Like, it's crazy what Jamar Chase does, bro. And to, to think, like, to think, oh, yeah, well, they still needed a blocker. It's stupid that they took him. Who cares how good he Are you kidding me? Do you know how many games they won? Like, they, they almost won a Super Bowl because of fucking Jamar Chase. Like, the plays That's that he's crazy. Like, That's what I'm saying. They should have won that. Hey, they should have won that Super Bowl. Bro, he's one, they of those guys won that, that Super Bowl. he's one of those guys that was he's one of those players in the NFL that can go 80 plus any any play. Any oh no play. doubt. That's special. That's no paper. Yeah, and Malik Neighbors can do that shit, bro. That's why it's like that's why it's so difficult to be like if he obviously we need alt, but you need to be able to score points, bro. Like if if we would have scored at least 30 points last year, we would have probably been right up there. Like literally. Like, uh, shit. We didn't lose much by by much. We really didn't. We just couldn't score. Fact. So that's facts. Again, you can't trust nobody out there. <laughs> that's funny as hell. <laughs> it's crazy. It's just like my boy said. I'd say Wilson two point oh. His rap name is Lil Panda. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> like the, fans said, the coaches, the coaching staff said when they started, uh, they they won't play. What they want playmakers and. There are a ton in this draft. We just have to find one or two that fits our team. You got to understand that when you're picking at seven, there's certain players that stand out way more than others. Like I keep explaining that guy Puka or whatever you say his name for the for the Rams. He's really good, right? Puka Nakua. Yeah, he's really good, right? But do you know why he of course. went? You know why he went to the later rounds, right? Because he's slow. He's yeah. slow. Fuck. He has no top speed. And that's not saying he's a bad player. You don't have to be fast to be good, obviously. But he's Catch not fast. the fucking ball. There was, that, there was that play. It was like second to last week in the season. <clears throat> he catches the ball and and keeps his balance inside, which is unbelievable. And he runs down the sideline and he gets caught. It would have been like a probably a ninety close to ninety yard touchdown, but it was like a seventy yard play because he got caught. Um, things like that is 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 why certain players slide. It doesn't mean they're going to be bad, but there's, but, but like you can't expl expect Puka to run by people playing 15 yards off on a go route. Malik neighbors can do that. Calvin Ridley can do that. Puka cannot do that. And it's not sliding. It's just, there's certain things that, that, that uh, we need specifically uh, on our team, having a, a quarterback that can throw the ball 80 yards in pads. So you have to be able to have guys that can run after the ball and make guys miss and do this, this, and that. So we'll see how it goes, man. I'm excited about it regardless. <laughs> he said, just the stupid ass Browns kicked. I hate the Browns, bro. I can't stand them. Ugly team. The oranges. 
Indeed, the Titan Kong says, seriously, if we can't get anybody we need at seven, just trade for Justin Jefferson at, in Big 20. Dude, there's no way we're getting him too much money involved in there, bro. Uh, poor, that man wants almost 180, 200 million. He's, he's, that fool's worth a lot of he's money. He's worth man. every fucking dollar, trust yeah, me. Yeah, but, but, but when you got Calvin really D hop and these guys, like, you can't be doing that. But like, I, like I've said before to you, bro, when we talk outside of this shit, we need at least one more receiver. Mm-hmm. I'll have a three receivers, great receivers. We will, but we're not going to be. We'll have Calvin. Tomorrow. We'll have Fuck Ridley. That. We'll have Calvin. We'll have fucking D. Up. I still want Higgins. I still want Higgins. There, I, I'm the only reason we're not getting any of those guys. Like, there's a reason why we got Calvin Ridley because we didn't have to trade anything this year for sure. But we, uh, you know what I'm saying? We didn't have to really trade anything. It was just like. And then same thing with Sneed. We didn't have to trade anything this year. It's just like things like that is 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 why we got those players for the most part on top of how good exactly. they already are. But but we we just aren't going to be giving up or trading upwards, you know, for dra- losing our draft picks, our high ones, especially when we're expecting Calvin Ridley and DeAndre Hopkins to go out there and ball. Oh, no doubt. So it is. No cool fucking doubt. What's up? No, I was like, we're gonna be all right, man. I, I think, uh, I think right now we gotta make sure we save some money as well. Um, we still could spend what we need to spend. We're we're fine. Got we got enough money for that, the draft class, whatever we need. Um, I just hope that uh, you know, we fill in the we fill in this roster the right way. You know, we still have some holes. Obviously, we need another pass rusher. We need another inside linebacker. We need another corner. We need, you know, we need a few things. Some more receivers. We need, you know, inside <laughs> defensive line. You know, right side of the O line needs needs to be filled in a little bit better. There's a lot we oh, need, course. bro. But there's a but lot that I, we have. I think it's gonna take at least one more season to be a great fucking team. We already have a good team right now, but to move to that next higher level. I say by next season. We'll be fucking great. Yeah, I I uh I just wanna see how how we look this year, you know. Hopefully we uh hopefully we as take of right now this is an easy this an easy ten plus one team this year. I think I think we have every opportunity to to win around nine, ten games if we um if we if we have a really good draft, bro, we have well, to have fast. a good draft. Um, and, and 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 again, that's what me and Billy are pretty much talking about. Um, if we we killed the, the we've killed this off season so far, unbelievable. Um, but can we kill the draft too, and then go into this season and really try to compete with the Texans? Um, even if the Texans win, it doesn't mean we can't go to the playoffs with a wild card spot. You know what I mean? It's not impossible. Let's go out there and shock. The, let's go out there and shock the world. And all, all the coaches that we've brought in are all winners from other franchises. <laughs> of course. Of course. All winners, bro. And how, and how we built this coaching staff, Frable couldn't do that. Mike Frable couldn't do none of that shit. Again, I gave that man so many chances and all that. We both, we both did, bro. We, we both helped but out a lot. If, we did. First off, guys, we have 91 fucking people watching. Shout out to you guys. 15 fucking likes. Oh, yeah. Let's get up to 30, 40 likes. Hey, the Let's likes see. are at the top of the top right, man. You'll see it on the top right of your phone or whatever you're watching it on. Hit those three dots. Like, comment, subscribe, you guys. <clears throat> if you're feeling generous, there's Super Chat. There's also Cash App, Money Sign, Titan Anderson. All donations and proceeds go towards channel upgrades, fellas. So, again, we appreciate it. Me and Billy Scott uh, holding it down. We, we're going to be, again, me, uh, obviously most of the stuff I do is by myself, but uh, we're going to start incorporating the channel mods, too, because, like I Bruh. said, man, they, they do so much behind-the-scenes shit that you guys have no idea about. Um, and, and again, I, I don't – I always try to I always try to say thank you for every everybody that does anything bro. for the channel. Again, bro, remember the good old days, bro? 400 people, 400 subs. Bro. Just me and you talking shit. Dude, it was crazy, bro. Yeah, that's like, a good old days, bro. Just, just that dream, bro. You know what I'm saying? That vision. You know, we put our thoughts together and we're like, this is a good thing. You know, we know. You know what I'm saying? And now bro, it's just it's getting there. Man. We it's built getting... this from the ground up. That's what people don't understand. They really don't. But it's all good. We're going we gonna, to we gonna carry this. We're going to carry this to the and next And we got level. people. We got haters out there and all that, bro. All you I got to say is. On Discord. The live Please. chat is is only on is only for the mods. Uh, if if you guys are in the Discord, it's not it's not just there. 
Yeah. It's not just for anybody. Yeah, this isn't this isn't just like an open panel thing. It's hey, just give me open. one second, but let me turn the light on. Yeah, you're good. How's everybody doing? I'm going to get to the chat real quick, man. We got 150 people watching. Get those thumbs up, fellas. We just had an hour and a half show earlier today. This one, we're going to go for about an hour and a half, two hours, if you guys keep it over 100 people. Uh, and then if you guys, again, if you guys dominate it, we'll do another show because we can. Uh, and again, for the people wondering about the donations, it's Cash App, Money Sign, Titan Anderson, or just do Super Chat. You're good there, too. That's going to be too fucking... That glare is going to fucking kill the fucking shit out of me. Yeah, I think fucking it. Just put the phone down. Like, aim it more downward to where you... Yeah, but hold on. I'm going to just turn the light back off, bro. Yeah, you'll be all right. we, got, we got 200 watchers, y'all. Hit that thumbs up, baby. Hit that thumbs up. Let's go. We got EC3 with the donation. EC3 supporting the channel, Titan. I appreciate you, EC3. Seriously, man, I really do appreciate you. I've noticed you've been doing hella, hella, uh, you know, supporting of the channel, being loyal, and that means a lot to me, man. I appreciate y'all. Thank or you for that. anything what I might do. Let's nah. see. Juan G says, okay, we got Texans in here. Y'all ready for Diggs to destroy y'all? <laughs> hey, man, you ain't ready for that. You ain't ready for that. You little Texans fans ain't ready for that. I'll tell you that much. Fuck the Texans. Well, no, bro, bro. San Diego Houston Texans fan club. What the fuck does that even mean? That's funny <laughs> as fuck. I don't even know Heck what yeah, that means. Bro. Yeah, that's funny, I heard bro. a California Titan fans, bro, but fuck the rest. So <laughs> Uh, you gotta love if that. You shit. fucking know, you fucking know, bro. Shout out to oh, the two hundred and nine people watching, bro. Yeah, shout out to everybody. Titan South says Callahan can develop play. Bro, it's, I'm telling you, it's gonna happen, bro. Hey, if you wherever you're watching from, I don't give a fuck. Put your team name in the chat in all caps. Let us know who your team is. Let us know who you want to draft. Put it in the hey. comment section below. Let's go. Spam your team's name below. Hey, but hey, so I gotta. Titan South told me to told me to tell you this shit though, all right? LA is better than San Diego. That's all we gotta say. Yeah. I don't think you know that's that, very right? accurate. I think that's very false. That's, well, that's very, very accurate. accurate. That is a hundred percent accurate. Titan South wouldn't lie. Titan South speaking to him. He says Sneed's gonna lock the crybaby ass digs down, my boy. He always does. He always locks his bitch ass down, Billy. He always shuts his bitch ass down. He doesn't score on Diggs, Billy. Talk to him. <laughs> Let these bitches know that Diggs is getting that fucking straight jacket treatment. You ain't moving, bitch. Tell him, Billy. <laughs> and, <laughs> hey, and talking about Titan South. <laughs> Titan South said, yes, sir, LA all day. That's all we got to say. I'm getting banged on, man. I'm hey, hold on, hold on. Time out. If you don't like fucking cussing, get the fuck out of the fucking chat. William Lewis says we have a group of Texans fans in Dago. I would love, I would love to interview you guys. Seriously. Hey, what do you guys hang get, out in San Diego? Get you, I, don't San Diego. With, I don't want to hang out with them. I, I just, just want to go down there and troll. That's all. I that's, just want to go down there and troll. Hey, hey, if y'all got a group, man, hit me up on Twitter and we'll, we'll get something. We'll get something on board. If there's three or four of you guys, because there's probably not more than four of y'all. Trust me. Uh, and and I'll match you guys, and we'll have a battle. It'll be it'll be us against you guys, and we'll we'll respectfully debate Titans versus Texans. Let's go, let's get it, bro. Let's fucking go again, guys. Pause for the fucking cause. One hundred and ninety-two. Yes, watching. sir. Get those likes up, fellas. Nineteen let's go. likes, guys. Come on. Watching. Let's keep it going, bro. If you uh, want a two-hour stream, we need fifty likes. Let's get those likes up, bro. EC three says. Ta, it's simple. You're the best Titans live streamer, bar none. I checked. Hey, it's it. I mean. Stats and facts don't lie. Stats and but facts. But some don't people lie. think. But hey, some people think otherwise. Yeah, I don't. You did. I don't. Know. It doesn't matter. Fuck that. I'm just saying. Yeah, dude. It don't. Tay Thompson says J C. Lath J C. Latham's a big <laughs> boy. He's a beast, bro. He's a beast. Uh, Juan G says Tennessee Titans select Marvin Harrison Jr. The Ohio State University. I hope so. I hope so. Bro, that, if he falls to us, bro, <laughs> <laughs> bro, we'll, we'll have we'll have the best coach. We'll have the best Colts wide receiver. Uh, his son, <laughs> bro. <laughs> if that does, hey, if that does oh, happen, bro, I'm drinking a whole bottle of Fireball that night. Bro, he'll be shitting on the Colts. No diapers. The titanium, Chris, <laughs> bro. What's good, my boy? Hope all Hell is yeah. fucking well. Titanium, Chris. What's up, big dog? Hey, you gonna be in LA? We're gonna be in LA, bro. bro for the, for the uh, let's meet up for that game again. Game. 
We're gonna be in LA Let's meet up for that game again. We're gonna show everybody what's up, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I got free parking. Even say, what's up, Billy? EC3 says, yeah, it's simple. I think I already read that, right? He's killing it. Yeah, that that's shit. when you just pinned it. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's, it's still okay. Now, I, I'm looking at my other phone for the comments. It's like, it's like, ah. There we go. It's all, it, it, it's like slower. Like my, my other phone, my good phone is like super fast. Like I, I got that like 5G on the go, like internet at fucking Wi Fi craziness. Bluetooth. This this shit's but, got two tone Bluetooth. Have you ever heard of that shit? Like it's crazy. Nah, but it's Team Android over Team iPhone, bro. Fuck iPhone. Yeah, I'm still struggling with this shit, bro. I'm I'm working on it. <laughs> Juan G says, "Brother, Colts are gonna cry and say we're trying to be like, dude. The Colts are trash. They go out and sign the same ass bums from this <laughs> from last season. They got the same players from last season, just on just on bloated contracts." <laughs> Y'all bitches looking like the blob from Marvel. Come on now. This is crazy. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> what, are we, what are we doing here? Them fucking poofy, jiggly puff looking ass. This is crazy. Oh my God. Uh, Titan South says Cheeto will lock down a court. That's you know what's funny? The Texans fans over there talking shit. They're like, you have that's what you have Sneed. Cool, it's one corner. We have two more core or receivers. Who you it's like, bro, what the fuck are you talking about? Roger McCreary is locked down on the inside, and fucking Cheeto Chidobia Wuzie is locked down on the other side. And they're and then ninety percent of those dipshits, if they respond, they go, "I forgot you had that guy." <laughs> it's like then fucking pay attention or don't try to come at me. Like, what are you doing? Like, know your sports. No, fuck the sports. Know your NFL if you're gonna come and diss me. Like, that's crazy to me. I forgot you had him, or it's either that or I didn't know you had him. Well, yeah, maybe you should pay attention more. Fucking goofball fruitcake. Haley says, do you think this will be the Titans' best season ever? No, of course not. No. That, that's crazy. It could be. Every, every Anything's possible, but unlikely. Titan South says, I'm going to try to sneak in, in, a patro in Patron for the Chargers. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Titan Kong says, if Marvin Harrison Jr., Becomes a Titans fan. It's over for the Texans. Preach it. Let's go. William Lewis says, whoever wins in the division between the Texans and Titans wins the Houston Bowl. LOL. Jesus Christ. Titanus says, TA got the 2100 type of phone. Bro, I got the uh, I got that uh, iPhone 15 Max Pro. Is it Pro Max or Max Pro? I never knew which one comes first. But I got that one, the blue titanium one. Bro, and I got that that 5G on the go. I dude, it's crazy. I got it. I got the like literally. I could drive. I can go on a mountain and go live. It doesn't matter. I can go to I can go to Mars and come back. It wouldn't make no difference. I'll still be live talking. So that's what I wanted to do. I, like I I gotta pay a lot for it, but it's worth it because you know what I'm saying. We're all we're all involved in shit, so it's it, it's all good. Let's see, Jonathan, how you doing, bro? Uh, Juan G says, man, you and your family got to make it to the draft party at Nissan Stadium. It was fire last year. Yeah, it's just I'm, I'm in California, so it's on the other side of the world, big dog. West Coast, the best coast. West Coast is the best coast. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> I love it, man. Like, I love the Titans. We love the Tennessee Titans, fellas. Don't get it twisted. But, you know, that California sunshine, you know, I'm no offense, no, no disrespect, Nashville and Tennessee, <laughs> but them tornadoes scare the shit out of me. <laughs> nah, I don't want to hey. be near them. If I saw one of them bitches, I don't know what I would do because it doesn't make sense to me. How does that happen? It doesn't happen around here. We don't get bruh, that. Coming, hey, we coming from Tennessee, earthquakes. though, bro. Coming from Tennessee, though, bro. I miss tornadoes, though, bro. That shit used to be fucking fun. No, fuck that. I don't want to be near that. I'd rather shit. go through a tornado than a fucking earthquake. Nah, if you just do, nah, fuck that. And we don't even get, yeah, LA get them, them. See, LA's earthquakes are a little bit, like, if, if it's an earthquake, like a 4.0, it's like a 5.5 .5 in LA, just because, you know, they get, they get, they they just aren't on the same level as us when it comes uh, to weather-wise. Uh, everyone, everyone thinks that LA is uh, a better place to visit, but it's definitely not true. Bro, I got, I got clear skies and nice breeze coming in, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got clouds. Whose skies look got better? Whose skies got look better, bitch? Look, I got palm trees. <laughs> I got palm trees. I got palm trees, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? I got palm trees. Pa those dead ass palm trees, Billy. Look like I got a palm Snoop Dogg blunt. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I got palm trees, bro. Fuck out of here. Look like a Snoop Dogg blunt over there, Billy. What of are you course, doing over bro. there? Snoop lives about two blocks away from me, bro. What you talking about? <laughs> That's Best Uncle Snoop, bro. bro. 
That's Uncle Snoop. Titanus says TA got the literal Titans phone in every ass, but y'all don't understand. This is not a joke. Like we we take this shit serious. Hell like. yes, I miss tornadoes, bro. I miss my four seasons, bro. I live in California where it's fucking hundred degrees every fucking day. Oh, not every fucking day, but a lot of the people, a lot of people in the Texans group are in the Marines and Navy here. Transplants. Congrats uh, to them for being in the military. Thank you for your service, but your team still fucking sucks. Yeah, I mean that's not gonna change, you know, anything. I'm, I mean, yeah, thank you for your service, but your team sucks. Like seriously, um, again, I would love to have them on. You know, we can say we can even start it out by, you know, thank you for your service, but you're gonna get cooked. Um, yeah. So, uh, it, yeah, find two or three guys, four guys, girl, doesn't even matter what they are. They can be aliens. They can be fucking. Golem from Pokemon. I, I I don't care. Like seriously. Like let's let get your little friends, get your group, and then I'll get my group, and we'll have a little battle. Titans versus Texans. We'll see if they. Let's see what's going on. Hey, again, pause for the cause. We got sixty people watching. All right, check twenty likes. So, Bentley D Danforth. I'm gonna give you your one minute of fame. He says, "Stop going on YouTube and start cussing because these kids on here stop cussing and going off on YouTube." Let me explain something real quick. Just real quick. <laughs> my my thing literally says I click not for kids. So if your kid it if your kid is on on an on an iPhone or whatever they're on uh, an i app whatever the fuck they're watching it on, and they're being per you know you're you're allowing them they're not being blocked from from this type of content that's on you guys. My shit says eighteen and up. And if you're going to be under 18, you better bring a parental signed uh, permission slip. <laughs> That's the rules, bro. It's just it is what it is. Oh, Titan Kong. Happy birthday, man. Appreciate it, man. You don't got to do don donations on your birthday, bro. I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much for the dono, man. Yes, sir. It's crazy. It's crazy. He says my birthday, man. That's wild, man. Happy birthday. Hopefully you have a good birthday today. <laughs> Curse Titans more than I got a palm tree tatted. That's what's up, bro. See, it's all about LA. See, Titan South, I respect you, brother. I fucking respect you. That man knows what's up. He knows LA is better than trash ass Diego. Yeah, he's he has his moments for sure. That's crazy. I appreciate that, dude. Yes, sir. Let me put this back up here. Is it? Yeah, it's not really hot. Right, cool. What's good? What's good, y'all? Holy fuck. It is crazy. I know, I can't believe it. How, how, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna guess how old he is. Titan Kong, Titan Kong is... 50. You say 50? I'm gonna say 23. Nah. <laughs> yes, sir. I know why is XD Gamer even here? Someone put him on a timeout so he can't talk. Let him stay here, but someone put him on a timeout. That dude's a freak. I already got you. Don't worry about it. Put, him on, a timeout. put, put that minutes, bum on timeout. You go. Fucking goofball. Hey, I'm yeah. 23. No. Wait, did I say? No. Did I say? No, he's 32. He's 32. Oh, he's 32. man, bro. I'm a little bit older than you, TK. You guys are old as fuck, bro. God damn. <laughs> Me and, Ty and, me and Ty and South are young as fuck. <laughs> oh, man. How we all feeling, man? The NFL draft, you guys, is creeping up so fast, man. So fast. I'm very excited. I'm going to put this one right here for right now. The NFL draft is creeping up fast, you guys. How are we feeling about the draft? Is there anybody that you really want us to draft automatically? You guys talk to me. He said, everyone is double my age. Titanus is that young ass dude that just knows how to do everything. But at least he has a, at least, hey, at least he has a parent permission slip to be here. So, congrats. <laughs> Titanus is that dude. He's dope, man. Titanus is that dude. Oh, shit. Hey, I love it, man. I, hey, so how are you feeling about Malik Neighbors? Are you, are you against him or you just don't want him at seven? Or, or you would, you I just okay think he him? has a lot of, Bad vibes, you can say. Okay. It's that party lifestyle. It's cool to do that shit, bro. But once you start getting DUIs, which he doesn't have, 
Broadway is an active place in Asheville. Downtown Asheville on Broadway, all those bars, you never know what someone's going to do. Yes, it can happen to anyone and everyone. But with people saying it's a party style, I don't know what to think. But again, it can happen to anyone and everyone. You know, I think um, I, I just think of the talent that Will Levis has. Did hey, did everybody in the chat, Billy? Did you see it too? Did you guys see uh, Will Levis working out, making that that crazy fast release throw right on point across his body across the field? Did you guys see that? What chat are you talking about? Uh, Will Levis was throwing in a practice. No, but I didn't see nothing. Yeah, he did a crazy ass throw that was just ridiculous. <clears throat> what and, today? Um, no, nah, it was, I don't know when it happened, Recent, recently, and it was just, it was crazy, like, he made the craziest, craziest throw, he said, yeah, I saw that, look, see, yeah, it was, uh, see, everyone saying it's effortless, it was insane, and when you see that type of quick release, we, you see that, and everything that he brings to the table, you just think, damn, bro, like, if we could block for him a little bit, like, if we could just give him the right amount of weapons, this guy could literally be Tom Brady with a stronger arm, like, literally, it's crazy, so, Dude. I'm just, I'm just hoping that that uh, I'm hoping that one of those receivers is there, Marvin Harrison Jr. or Malik Neighbors. If they're not there, take Joe Alt or trade back. That's it. That's, that those are only four options for me. Do we know who shut up for voluntary practice? I don't, I, don't know. I don't know. Chat section, you can answer. That. I haven't checked any of that, bro. I, I just took the kids to school. I brought us. Woke up about like an hour and a half ago. Yeah, I, I, I took the kids to school and I was live. Or this is the second time I've been live already. Yeah, I missed your first live stream, bro. I was knocked the fuck out. Neighbors is a beast. Jonathan, I'm a board neighbors, but I know our O-line is hurting at the tackle position. That's a fact, bro. Oh, well, that just makes sense. I'm says I don't listen to rumors. Uh, let's see. William Lewis says whoever takes Martin Harrison Jr., he's going to leave to go play for his boy Stroud when his rookie contract is up. Yeah, that's true. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, a lot of people are saying that it was a crazy. But it was a beautiful throw, bro. Like, it really was. Uh, Ty Kong says, Will Levis makes those Texans look like cannon fodder. Take that, te uh, Texan traveling butt wives. Also, I was in the military too, and I'm a Titans fan, and I got dudes who, who's served are dedicated Teutonians. I love that. I love that. Interview some of them dudes. I love it, bro. Titanus says, I think our offensive core is fine. I think we need a little bit more speed, a little bit more speed. Outport. That part. Yeah, we need a little bit more speed. Just a little bit. Yeah, we'll but I just want to build on the O line this year. That's all I yeah. want to do. Mm -hmm. We got now if, we, if we, we have to. We have no choice. We have to. If we can get Tony Pollard as a re running receiver, bro, we're fucking straight. That man had like what nine hundred yards receiving last year. Dude, both of our running backs are, are going to get so many receiving yards this year. They both are really good at that. It's crazy. Bro, we're, we're going to do shotgun formation with Pollard on the left and Tashi on the right. We're going to throw it deep to De DeAndre Hopkins, touchdown, fucking Titans. Let's get it. Bro, I'm, I'm just, like I said, I'm just, I'm, I'm ready for this, bro. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This shit's going to be crazy. That's crazy. Well, let, let me let me ask you one 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 more thing real quick. Um, what do you what do you think? Um, what do you think the Titans initially do? What, what are we gonna do? What what are we gonna do at seven? Or do you think the honestly, honestly, I don't see those three people being there. In my honest opinion, so I see them trading back. I do see them trading back. If it's with the Vikings or fucking whomever. It may be the fucking Raiders. You never know. The Raiders need help. They need a quarterback. Minshew's going to be Raiders fucking are, trash, bro. Raiders are, another, Minshew, Raiders are another team that's on that watch, bro. Exactly. There's a lot of teams that need a fucking quarterback. Yeah. Shit, we can trade fucking Malik Willis to you, though. Give us a fifth-round pick, sixth-round pick. Get him more than we can have him. Yeah, he's something, man. Malik Willis. See, you never know, man. Another man trash be another man treasure. Yeah, Malik Willis is terrible, bro. He is so bad. It's crazy. Uh, top tier says, I think Joe Alt will be there. Neighbors and Marvin Harrison Jr. will be gone. And that's what it mostly will probably seem like. 
Um, oh, she brought that thing over. I was like, what the fuck is that? That's crazy. Uh, Titanus says, TA, if we trade back, would you want Roma Dunn's Olu fashioning or Brock Bowers? If we trade back, I'm, I'll Brock Bowers. Or, no or, doubt. Or give me um, um, uh, Turner. I would take him, Dallas Turner, any day of the week. Oh, look at baby T.A. Baby T.A. in the building. He... Oh, my little man. He's the best. He's back from school. <laughs> he got took inside. He's on, he's on, a, he's on another. Uh, it's like a. Um, they ha We have people come to the house and. And like, you know. Help early start type shit. So he's in class in here too. He does it like it's crazy. Poor kid has so many, so much school. Yeah, he said TA isn't a fan of Rome. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, we'll get into it in a second. Hey, Billy, you want to say anything else? Time to fuck up. <laughs> it's our season. Fuck the haters. Fuck everyone. It's our fucking time. Let's go. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna probably talk for a little bit more and just get off. All right, cool. I'm gonna go charge my phone. Yeah, thanks for coming in. I got you. All right, later, bro. Hey, shout out to Billy Scott, bro. Like, seriously, man, seriously. Shout out to Billy Scott. Uh, stopping in real quick, showing showing that love, showing that support. Uh, how's everybody doing out there? How's everybody doing? How are we feeling about the draft coming up, man? Uh, if you're watching and you, if you're watching me, you guys, I'm going to be honest. If you're watching and you're not hitting like, you are a fucking goofball. Seriously, bro. It's crazy, man. Come on, man. Show that support, bro. <laughs> I mean, seriously. It's like, there's so many people who be watching and not hitting like. It's like, what are y'all, like, what the fuck? And, and it's crazy. They be commenting like crazy, but. You know, it is what it is. People are crazy. Yes, sir. Hell yeah. Tennessee Titans, man. Tennessee Titans. Who are we going to draft, bro? Malik Neighbors? Is Malik Neighbors coming? Marvin Harrison Jr., Joe Alt. Everyone thinks that the, that, that the Tennessee Titans can't stop uh, the Texans. Everybody thinks that the Titans are going to get last. ESPN's over there having us, what, second to last and, and possibly finishing with zero wins? Like, what the fuck? Who, who comes up with this shit? Are we serious? Like, what the fuck? The disrespect towards our team is fucking crazy. It's just crazy. Fucking wild, bro. Like, <laughs> doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Oh, man. Jonathan says, my eyes hurt after... <laughs> uh, I don't even see the... I don't think the eclipse is coming, bro. Like, I don't... I think... I think... I think San Diego has dodged the eclipse. I'm just gonna keep it 100. I think San Diego has dodged the eclipse. <laughs> oh man! Titanic says, "As long as Malik Neighbors works hard and is uh, willing to do good, I'm all in." Hey, me too. Like I said, uh, Malik Neighbors is somebody that's going to change everything if he's able to come. Uh, we'll, we'll be able to give uh, we'll be able to give Will Levis that younger weapon that he can grow with. Um, Calvin Ridley is going to be there for the future, the, the now and near future. D Hop's there for the now. Who knows about his future? Uh, you know, future or whatever. Um, that could be so much firepower, bro. So much fucking firepower. Oh man, it's crazy. So crazy. As uh, what do you say? Hold on, let me go back, bro. This thing's acting funky as hell. He says, uh, let's see. TK says, imagine if we got Dallas Turner, Fuaga, and Xavier Worthy. Oh, my God. That, <laughs> that's so, I mean, if we trade back, we'll see what happens, bro. But, I mean, it's, I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, Titan Kong says, Raiders can give us their 13 and second rounder and third rounder for our seventh. That would be cool. How would you guys feel about that? I actually would be okay with that. Let me explain why. We already have the 38th pick. We'll get their second round pick, which I don't know where it is. Um, but it's still solid. Raiders need a, need a quarterback. So trade up to seven, you get your guy, right? We can get a, a third rounder, which we don't have. 
and then we'll have two second rounders and that first rounder by move. That's insane, bro. That's that's great value. So again, Raiders are another team where we can go out there and try to finesse. Should the Titans go out there and do that? Let's say we do do that. We get the 13, two second rounders and a third. I mean, that third rounder, you can do so much with it. Um, that's an interesting one in its own right. But you would have the 13th pick. At the 13th pick, you're probably going to want to take J.C. Latham. That's who I would take. I'm just going to keep it a band. Um, him or Fuaga would be nice at 13. Olu would probably, I don't know if he's even going to be there, but I don't even like Olu much. Uh, you'd have two second rounders. So, um, you know, you could, you obviously got to get receiver with one of them and pass rusher with the other one. Uh, and then the third rounder, you could probably go middle linebacker or vice versa. You can swip it around, flop it around. You could do so many different things, bro. So many different things. That's why I like this shit. He says, baby, T ate the goat. Titan South says, I wouldn't mind Rome Odun's not at all at seven. What? I wouldn't mind a Duns, but not at seven. Okay. Yeah, me, I'm I'm on the same thing. It's like when I say I don't like Roma Duns, I'm more I'm more specifically saying at seven, I just it's too high. I like at 13, if we had pick 13 and he's still there, I would be oh, I'd be perfectly fine with that. But at pick seven to take a risk on a guy whose explosion level is iffy, that's crazy to me, bro. Like, fuck no. We're not doing that. It's crazy. It's so crazy. He says, I'm hyped for the draft. Dude, I think everybody is, bro. Everybody's at the at the point now where they're just like, let's go, bro. Like, who's going to be the, on this team? Who's going to win? Who's going <sighs> to... Last year's draft was so good. So good. Is anybody Is anybody else excited? For Ty J Spears, am I the only guy excited for Ty J Spears? Come on, y'all. Rudy says Titans should trade their pick for to Dal to Dallas for nothing. Yeah, and you should uh you should go swim with the sharks, bro. Uh, and uh, yeah, and just be very careful. Just be very careful. Um, Titanus says T A B. Yeah, <laughs> that's crazy. Titan Kong says Malik Willis should be in. What be the water boy and help his fellow neighbor and give him some water and Gatorade, bro? Malik Willis is gonna be, I guess, battling it out with Rudolph. I guess we'll see. Afio says I do keep hearing interest in is growing for for neighbors. If there is, if there is, if so, I think uh, they move on from Burks right after the draft. That could happen. We'll see. Uh, top tier says I'm tired of waiting. I want the draft now. Trust me, I get it. Trust me, I get it. William says, like I said two weeks ago, this is a deep draft. Uh, smart thing to do is trade back, stockpile picks. Had no problem with Texans trading theirs to Minnesota. It's crazy, bro. That's what I'm saying. We just don't know what's going to happen, man. We just don't know. We just don't know. Let me try to put this up here for a little bit. Appreciate all the donations as well, you guys. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Oh my God, this is crazy, bro. This is crazy. He said everybody came to practice. He said three lives today. I don't know, man. We'll see. We'll see, man. We, we, like we we we're getting a bunch of views and stuff. A lot of a lot of you know a lot of people showing support, man. But them likes is low, man. A lot of a lot of haters are showing up, not hitting that thumbs up. Uh, but again, overall great shows, man. Great shows. A lot of fun today. Titan Kong says, I'm excited to see Malik Willis progress once he uh, once he loses to Rudolph in the back of bro and he starts painting stuff and hanging up signs and cleaning out the stadium. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God, bro. Come on, bro. What are we doing here? <laughs> Damn. Well, you guys, we got uh, we got six more minutes to hit that one hour mark. Let's get it up. Everybody stop. Hit the like button. Let's go. Come on, fellas. Let's go, man. If we can get more people in here, we'll go for an hour and a half. Everybody spam your favorite football team. Everybody spam your favorite football team. It's crazy. Just waiting for them to leave, and then we'll be back inside, ready to go. 
Yeah, Arden Key's good, man. He's a good player. He's a good player. That's crazy, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> hey, yo, let's go. What's up, fellas? Y'all can't spell Titans without putting that T A in it. Bro, the Texans are trash. The Texans are trash. The Colts are trash. Someone convinced me otherwise. Anybody out there really think the Jaguars are going to go to the playoffs? Is there anybody, anybody in this world that thinks that the Jaguars are going to go to the playoffs? Hell no. The Jaguars are complete dog chocolate. They shit the bed, no diaper, every single season, bro. Trash. Trash. What up, Pedro? Big Dwight says Texas. Dude, the Texans are trash. I keep telling you. William says, T.A., I'll see what's up with some of the other Texans fans in the group I'm close with. They on deployment right now, though. That's what's up, bro. No no big deal. Take care of business. I get it. I get it, bro. Uh, he says, you know the Texans not trash. Texans are trash. They're going to get their ass whooped this year. Everybody want to continue to count my boys out, my Teutonians. The Tennessee Titans are going to come and slap the shit out of the Texans. Stop crying about our uniforms, J.J. Watt. Shit's getting old. Shit's annoying. Hey, raise your hand in the chat right now if you're tired of hearing Texas fans cry about Love You Blue. Can we get a hashtag Love You Blue going in the fucking chat right now? Because I'm tired of hearing the Texans fans cry and cry about the uniforms. They just got those splinter-looking uniforms. Literally, like, come on, bro. And, and you don't like them? You never even used them yet. And yet all you want to do is continue to cry, 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 cry about Love You Blue. Don't worry about Love You Blue. It has nothing to do with you. Has nothing to do with you. They're our jerseys, our colors, our history, ours. Stay the fuck away. Stop talking about it. Stop talking and crying about the Titans stealing the fucking Houston Oilers uniforms in history and shit. It wasn't stolen. You guys pissed it away. You guys didn't give a damn. You weren't loyal enough. You didn't deserve to have them. That's what it comes down to. You didn't deserve it. Jonathan says all these toilet... All these toilet seat mouth breathers hyping up AR got me laughing, bro. This man is a better running back than quarterback, but sure, let's believe he's about to go off. Bro, I keep saying, like, why do people think he's so good? Pause. 50, 57, 39. Like, why do people think Anthony Richardson is so good? I don't understand it. It doesn't make sense to me. What has he won? Who has he beaten? What? It, show me something other than him running the ball. Like, literally, it's all he does is run the ball. What happened when he tried to outrun Harold Landry? He got took into WrestleMania 40 and dropped on his fucking head. That's what happened, bro. It's crazy. This ain't a game. You got to stop playing with us, Texans fans, Jags fans, Colts fans. You guys all have to realize. You guys all have to realize this team is here. This team is here ready to go. We're here to play. We're here to win. We're here to compete for division titles. We've got our quarterback. The coaches are in place. It's our time to fight. Swords out. Armor on. Go to war time. Activated. Let's go. Come on, baby. And that's why we need more receivers. Fuck the blocking. Fuck the blocking. We need receivers. Throw the ball. We need guys who can go and score from 80-plus any play of the game, anywhere, anytime. That's what we need. The Tennessee Titans need it to work. Tennessee Titans are coming. Everybody can keep hating, keep saying all the negative comments you want. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, the Tennessee Titans know what's best. The Tennessee Titans know how to beat the Jaguars. We ended their seasons last year. Who's responsible for ending Trevor Lawrence and the Jaguars' golden season? We did. We did. We fucking ended them. That's what we always do. Remember their perfect little season back in the day? They thought it was going to be them and the Rams in the soup. No! No! 
It wasn't. We beat them twice. You're not going to beat us. The Jaguars, we, we, we beat you so many times. It's, it's, we're starting to, we're, we're just starting to forget things. Like, I, I, I think, I think it's gotten so bad with, with it, it's gotten so bad with what we've done. How many stiff arms, how many players has Derrick Henry ran over and your players don't even remember where they are? Like, I mean, how many times have we, how, have we put you guys, uh, you know, on the back of a, of a milk, of a milk case, you know, missing child, like, all your players getting thrown into the stadiums and we can't find you guys the next day. Like, where are they at? Like, it's crazy. Um, you know, Derrick Henry breaking all these records against you stupid ass jungle kitty cats, Jacksonville Jaguars. No, the Jacksonville jungle kitty cats. You guys ain't y'all are the worst in the division. You're going to probably get last. You better beat the Colts. You better beat the fucking Colts. Cause the Colts ain't going nowhere. Colts, Woo! Colts and those alternate black helmets, the Walmart toilet seat logo Colts. Get out of here with that shit. You better stop running the ball. You better stop acting like you're a running back. I'm getting tired of seeing that shit. Stop running the football. Anthony Richardson, I'm, I'm talking to you. Stop running because you can't take hits. Stop running because you're not as fast as you were, as you think you are. Just because you can outrun people in college every once in a while, that shit's not going to happen in the NFL. It's not happening. That shit is done. Over with. The Titans are coming to win the South this year. The Titans have Will Levis. The Titans have Calvin Ridley. The Titans have Legereus Need, DeAndre Hopkins. We've got it all. Chidobe Awuzie, new coaching. Brian Callahan, I can't wait. We got his pops too. Bill Callahan. We got everybody moving. Don't think we didn't forget about Lloyd Cushenberry. Arguably the best center in football. Don't play with me about Lloyd Cushenberry. We replaced Ben Jones and we got our, we got, we literally got our next Ben Jones. We got our next Ben Jones. That's how highly I think of Lloyd Cushenberry. Quit playing with me, you guys. Come on. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Let's go, bro. This is crazy. This is crazy. These toilet seat fans don't know what they're talking about. They think they're so good. I don't know why. Why do they think they're good? Why, why do the Colts fans think they're any good? Why do they think that their quarterback is the next best thing like Brock Lesnar in 2002? It doesn't make sense. Where are they getting that? What are you watching? What are they watching? We got 250 people watching, man. Let's go. If y'all ain't subscribed yet, if you ain't hitting like, you a goofball gumdrop fucking weirdo like let's get it going baby tennessee titans you can't spell titans without putting my name's initials in it t a i love y'all man there ain't nothing more important nothing more important right now in sports than the tennessee titans and what they're gonna do going forward what do the titans do going forward this draft is crazy so many teams are going to want to possibly trade up. Vikings got ammunition. We've got the Raiders with ammunition. Guys need to come up and get a quarterback, but it's not cheap. It's going to cost a pretty fucking penny. Can the Titans pull off a crazy trade? Can they get it done? Make history. Can we do another draft? Can Rand Carthon, the Wizard of Oz, the Wizard of the Draft, fuck that. Let's get it going, man. Look at what he did last season. Look at what Rand Carthon did last season. Talk to him. Will Levis in the second round? The fuck? Peter Skaronsky, first round, respectfully. Ty J, by God, the Barber Spears. In the third round, Josh Wiley, fourth round. Four guys that are big parts of this team going forward, bro. Come on, what are we talking about? This is crazy, bro. This is crazy. The Tennessee Titans are here to play, bro. So people can keep sleeping on us all they want. That's fine. It's all good. But you guys got to understand something. You got to understand something. We've made moves. And everybody that may hate us but pays attention to football knows exactly what the fuck I'm talking about. Everybody, whether you hate my team, you hate me, it don't fucking matter. You're going to respect this team. This year when you play us, you better hope to God you bring your A game. And you better hope to God you don't play us later in the season when the chemistry starts to build. Because we're about to break and bad all you bitches and we're going to take you all out. We're going to bring that shiny crystal, that blue crystal, and we're going to energize ourselves up, man. We blew kryptonite around here. We everybody's blue kryptonite, and we taking everybody out. 
We taking everybody out like the blue Walter White, baby. We ain't playing. Jesse Blumen. Fuck Jesse Pinkman. Jesse Blumen over here. We ain't playing. We over here, the blue Bret Hart. We ain't kidding. This t- this team's ready to go. We're ready to we're ready to compete. We're ready to get it down. We're ready to do work. The Tennessee Titans have done a lot in the offseason. And again, all the haters want to be like, oh, you haven't done anything. You guys sucked last year. Okay, keep thinking that. Keep thinking that that's the same fucking thing happening because we ain't nothing like last year. This team looks nothing like last year. Everything's different, bro. The fucking teams are way different. The quarterbacks are different. The blocking's way different. Running back. Derrick Henry's gone. It's a different team, bro. Like Ryan Tech. Come on, bro. So all of you goofballs that continue to say that stupid shit is crazy, bro. Is stupid, bro. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, man. Let's get to the comments for a little bit. I love it, man. He says AR-5 more like water pistol. Dude, it's a fucking water gun, bro. AR-5. What is he? Come on, bro. He's a water pistol. Get it down, little water gun. Pew, 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 pew. Better not shoot it, man. You know? It's crazy. It's crazy. I love it, man. You got it. You just got to love it. You got to love it because there's always people denying, hating, not accepting, not, not respecting the Titans. It's all good. Whatever. Who gives a shit? It's all good. Let them, let them. All we're going to do is go out there and Walter white people. And we're going to go out there and put people to bed in this two tone blue, baby. <laughs> I love it, bro. Let's go. William Lewis says, Bud Adams did some crap. Dean Spanos did in San Diego. He still lived in Houston until he passed away. And Amy Adams still is in Houston half the year. Who gives a shit? Cool. Big deal. Big fucking deal. Big fucking deal. Doesn't matter. She probably has a house in San Diego, too. I can guarantee you that. These rich people have billions of dollars and have houses everywhere. So when they travel somewhere, they don't have to fucking just leave right away or go to a fucking hotel. They got places everywhere, bro. Like, come on. What are we talking about here? What are we talking about here? Jonathan says Titans uh hanging 50 on the Colts, Jags, and Texas. I'm going to be like this. We're sweeping the Jaguars, we're sweeping the Colts, and we're going even with the Texans. Five out of six for the Tennessee Titans. Bookmark this, bitch. <laughs> yes, I promise y'all. I promise you guys. I promise you guys. People can sleep on us. They can't. That's fine. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. But when we start racking up wins and we start stacking them up like Legos, don't join the wagon. Don't join the wagon because me and my Teutonians are going to kick you the fuck right off. Right the fuck off. Wu-Tang says this season's going to be fun to watch. It's going to be great, bro. A lot of fun. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I'm excited about it. I can't wait, bro. You say we suck but went 0-2 against us. Who cares about last year, Chris Kaler? We're a different team. Derrick Henry's gone. Coaches, all of them, gone. We brought in Legereus Sneed. He replaces Christian Fulton. Do you remember him? You probably don't exactly, so shut the fuck up. Guess who else we replaced? Uh, Sean Murphy Bunting, respectfully. For who? Another number one rece- a corner in this league, buddy. So pay attention. You think we're just people? What about Calvin Ridley? You think we didn't do anything? That's why it's so funny. We- oh, we beat you last year. Who cares? That's last year. Who gives up? A- what does last year's Titans team have to do with this one? Nothing. Pay attention, you child, or go away. Damn, some people are just dumb, bro. Crazy. Wu-Tang says, keep this channel growing too funny, LOA. Hey, we ain't stopping, bro. Make sure you guys hit that like button, man. Show that support, though. Let's get it up. Let's get it up. I love it, man. Yeah, Callahan is different, bro. It's crazy. All these people come back with the same... The same type of uh, dumbass c- responses or or comebacks or or trying to diss me or whatever or the Titans is crazy. It's like y'all y'all really talking about stuff from last year when we have nothing to do with last year, bro. Doesn't make any sense at all. It doesn't make any fucking sense, bro. What's Josh Allen have to do with with Will Levis? Nothing at all. Nothing. Nothing. Nobody. Yeah, Texans fan for life says Colts think they're good. Colts, dude, the Colts are lost, bro. Their team sucks. 
they went out and paid the same people big ass contracts because nobody else wanted to play for them. Nobody wanted to take their calls. Nobody wanted to visit because, hey, when you go to Indianapolis, what the fuck is there to do? Name, go ahead, wait. I'll test y'all. Name three things, three things to do in Indianapolis. Don't worry. 30 seconds. I'll wait. Go ahead. I mean, I mean, just in, in San Diego alone, I mean, you could do any. You got the beach, you got the bay, you got you you got PB, you know, which, which is kind of like a boardwalk, uh, beachy, uh, you know, bar area. Fucking dope as hell. You can go to SeaWorld. Yeah, I mean, you could, you could. There's endless things that you could possibly do. I, I'm I'm just trying to think. I mean, the malls. I mean, I could go on for days. But my 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 thing is, what is there to do in Indianapolis? There ain't shit to do. There ain't nothing to do. What is there? Maybe a Walmart. Cool. Cool. You know how many of those fucking things we have over here? We have one on every fucking 10 blocks. It's crazy. Like, what are we talking about? It's crazy to me. There ain't nothing to do in Indianapolis. That's why nobody wants to play for them. And their jerseys suck. Crazy, bro. Colts, the toilet seats coming in last. Jags third. I, I, I mean, that could happen. It very well could happen. Let them battle it out for that bullshit ass bottom of the barrel spot. Uh, Wu Tang says the first game of the season is going to be fun to watch. New team, I can't wait, bro. But uh, uh, according to a lot of these goofballs, the, the Titans are the same team as last year. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. People think that we're the same team as last year. Wu Tang says you stuck in California traffic. That shit don't move. I'm not. The, the car's just on because of the AC. I'm just chilling in the car, bro. I'm just chilling in the car. Yeah, we're gonna be way better. He says, y'all ain't making the playoffs. We might not make the playoffs. It's not about that for the Titans. I mean, it's always what we want. But this season for the Titans is about taking that next step, about trying to get to the next level. That's what this is about. Trying to show improvement that you got the right guy at quarterback. That's what this is about. He says, is this drugs? How you believe in? This is crazy. Mike Roman. You're just mad because Roman Reigns lost the belt. Shut up. <laughs> Titan Thor, I see you, bro. Oh, man, I love it. I love it, man. Y'all have been kicking ass all day, bro. All day. Oh, man. Wow. What a wild-ass day for live streaming. Wow. Let's see. William says, San Diego, you can be in the snow and then drive 45 minutes and then go jump in the ocean. You know what's funny is that is true. That is true. Uh you know, we don't get snow in San Diego, but uh, I mean, if you go up to like Julian or a little bit like, like 40 minutes away or something like that, then, you know, you can very easily go to snow. It's not that far. And then the beach is down the street. You know what I mean? I, I live close, kind of close to a beach. So yeah, like it's crazy. Uh, Titan Kong says, I currently live there in Indianapolis and I'm originally from Tennessee. If it wasn't for work, there really isn't shit to do. I'm, that's what I'm saying. There's nothing to do in Indianapolis. It's a boring ass place. There ain't shit to do. How many people are like, oh, I can't wait to go and check out Indianapolis this off season, this summer. Oh man, I can't wait to go for Christmas. Let's go. Me and the family's going to Indianapolis, baby. I can't wait. Fuck no, not never. That shit don't ever happen. There ain't nothing to do there. There ain't shit to do there. I mean, if you want to go there and buy some cheap ass property, I mean, all, do, go do what you got to do. Respect, bro. Go raise a family. Go do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? Go work at that one Walmart over there and go. You know what I'm saying? You go sell. You go sell them Snickers and you go and sell them, you know, them pajamas and them and them Cokes and stuff. You do what you got to do, boo boo. But at the end of the day, guess what? There ain't shit to do in Indianapolis. The team is trash and they ain't going nowhere. William says Legoland, SeaWorld, San Diego Zoo, beaches. Yeah, but Legoland is uh, Legoland is. Is um is that even considered? That's not really San Diego though. Like I mean, some people consider it like San Diego County or whatever. I, I or I don't even know. I don't consider. I'm sorry. I just don't. It's it's Legoland is like 40 minutes away. Like let's be like it is 35 if you drive fat. Like Legoland is not San Diego. I'm sorry. I just can't consider it. Sea World definitely is. The zoo definitely is beaches the gas lamp uh, dude downtown is there ha, downtown san diego baby the gas lamp bro you know uh, uh, there's a bunch of shit going on coronado i yeah, coronado is pretty cool coronado is hella 
man, if you play golf or, or you're old, that's where you want to go is Coronado. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, isn't that where the Navy, the Navy SEALs train there, too? Yeah, Dago's dope, though. I know there's not shit to do in Indy. I know that. You ain't got to tell me. I know that. You ain't got to tell me, bro. You ain't got to tell me. I appreciate everybody again, man. I appreciate everybody for their, you know what I'm saying, for showing up and showing out, man. We, we're kicking ass on this stream. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, man. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, make sure you guys do. Yeah, San Diego's amazing. I love it. OBPB, Mission Beach. Yeah. I mean, OB's kind of kind of whack. PB's dope. Mission Beach is Mission Beach is cool. You just got to catch it at the right time. There's a lot of problems that happen at Mission Beach. Yeah, Mission Beach can get wild. <laughs> Mission Beach can get wild, man. Titan Thor says, did you grow up in San Diego or did you move there from somewhere? No, I grew up here. I, I, uh, I, I've been, I've lived here since I was two. So yeah, I'm a, I'm a San Diegan, bro. Yeah, Mission Beach is crazy. He says OB is locals only. Yeah, OB, I don't know. OB kind of, eh. A little grimy over there, but I don't really like it. I'm gonna keep it a band. I don't. Really, I don't really fuck with it over there. It's not really. It's not really. I mean, I just. I, I would rather just go to every other place you name. To be, <laughs> to be honest, you know what I'm saying. Oh man, I appreciate you guys. We still got like 15 minutes to go, you guys. We're gonna go to the hour and a half mark. Appreciate you guys so much, man. I really do. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the show. Uh, th this channel is growing so fast, bro. Like literally the, uh, you know, every single stream now, every single stream we do, we're guaranteed to always, it seems like always reach 200 plus people watching. Um, you know, we we're live for a long time, so it goes up and down, but, um, just shout out to everybody, man. Again, the watch time, the viewers, everything is crazy right now. It keeps going up. He says, yeah, grimy is the right word. Yeah. It's just, it's, it's just kind of an, icky place you know what i mean if you feel me an icky place it's not really the greatest uh he said i live in encinitas for 10 years yeah encinitas is not san diego for sure i don't know do you consider that san diego i wouldn't encinitas is bro encinitas is again probably 50 minutes away from me probably 40 50 minutes i'm i drive fast so it kind of just it varies i guess Bro, you know, like, the whole fucking San Diego area, bro. It's fucking funny, bro. Yeah. What's up? What's up, fellas? Yeah, y'all all need to switch football teams. All you guys, all you non-Titans fans are, are rooting for the wrong fucking teams. All you non-Titans fans rooting for the wrong goddamn teams. Tighten up, fellas. Come on, y'all. We still got 15 minutes to have some fun, man. Let's go. Let's get it going, man. I appreciate all the people who have used that super chat, all the people who sent through Cash App. Thank you guys so much, man. All donations help the channel's upgrades. William says, yeah, I do. And Sanita's only 20 minutes from where I live in Mission Valley. You said you live in Mission Valley? Mission Valley is, Mission Valley is pretty close to where I am, bro. If you live in Mission Valley, you're pretty close to me. You, you, you like... Yeah, you're pretty close, bro. You're pre not not like walking distance, but you're pretty close. You're pretty close to me. Hell yeah. Um, Mission Valley is a Mission Valley is a fun area. I like Mission Valley. I like I like uh, Fashion Valley too. I mean, kind of similar area. Texan fan says I've watched the Texans in the worst when we had Davis Mills. I know what a fucking tomato can, right? Uh, Wu Tang says, "Haha, even non-Titans fans here, you're doing something right. It's it's funny, bro. Like, but they but people aren't hitting like, bro. Like, I don't I don't get it, man. I know a lot of a lot of people are haters and stuff. They don't, you know. But YouTube sees what's going on. They see they see that they they may not be hitting like, but they're staying and they're watching. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So YouTube's not dumb. They got the craziest fucking algorithm. What's up, Joey? Joey, what's up, bro? We gotta start getting some fucking. You gotta start coming on here with me and talking football, bro." You know what I'm saying? We just shoot the shit, talk football. These rooms are getting crazy, bro. Like, my watch time's going way up, man. Everything, the, Everything's just looking good, man. Like, 
everybody make sure you subscribe to Joey. He's actually one of the guys that I've learned a lot from. Um, and I'm sure he, he's probably learned a few, few, few things. Hopefully he's learned a few things from me. I mean, that'd be nice. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, one thing the, and I've told him this before, the biggest thing I've learned from him is being consistent. He's, uh, I mean, if, if consistency, man, I, I mean, literally, man, li consistency is, is every, he's, he's the dude's, the dude's awesome, man. And, and, and for real, man, he's a, he's a good guy, man. He's a good guy. One of these days, Joey, we go, we gonna we gonna meet up, man, and cause some hell and watch some watch some slashers, bro. You know what I'm saying? You know, it, it'll it'll be dope, bro. It'll be dope. That guy's a good. Everyone should should should, should subscribe. He's an Eagles fan. Fuck his team, but but he's a um, he's knowledgeable as fuck, and he is a great content creator, man. And he's a good guy, man. He's a good guy. He really is. Appreciate you for showing showing up. Yeah, we'll get it going, man. We can we can talk AJ Brown. We could talk it all, bro. We could you know what I'm saying? Talk the upcoming season. We don't have to. We don't, you know what I'm saying? There's nothing wrong with two guys from other teams going live and talking sports, bro. There ain't nothing wrong with that. Uh, let's see. William says, typo Oilers. I tried rooting for them when they moved to Tennessee, but once they changed the name from Oilers, it wasn't the same for me. So I wanted, I waited for the Texans to come uh, in 02. So who was your team in the middle of the pack? In those, in those middle years, who did you root for? That's where I'm confused. You get what I'm saying? That, who, so who were you? Were you just like watching football and not really a fan or you tell me? Excuse me. God damn. Uh, William says, yeah, we stay right up the 163. Our house overlooks Mission Valley and Birdland. Damn, Birdland, bro. Birdland, isn't, isn't Birdland by Kearney High School? I, I went to Kearney High School for my first two years, bro. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, Birdland, man. I remember I remember dudes going over there to fight. <laughs> I remember dudes going over there to fight like on some stupid shit. That's hilarious. I, I don't I never went there, but at least I I mean I I've probably been in the area before not knowing, but I'm familiar of, of, of Birdland for sure. That's funny as hell. He's I'll make it Hey Titanus man. Hey, Titanus, bro. I need you to message me when you get a chance. Um there, there's something I want to talk to you about um, that that me and you could just just trust me, okay? It could be it's and it's not, it's it's something that we could talk with the mods or just personal message. There's nothing that we're trying to hide from anybody. Uh, you know, everything that that we talk about, we could talk in front of the mods. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, but yeah, hit me up. I got I got I got something that I got something that I, I think would be a good idea. <laughs> trust me, bro. Yes, hey Billy, just dropped that uh, Joey Shake subscription. Uh, the link for, to subscribe, man. Legit. William says, I rooted for some of the Titans players still ended up rooting for the Chargers in between. Mm, interesting. Yeah, it's across from 163 from Linda Vista. Yep. I know I know the I'm very familiar with Linda Vista area. I'm very familiar with that shit. Linda Vista, Claremont, Balboa, fucking um Terrasana, like Sarah Mesa. I mean. It's crazy, bro. Like those places, Mission Valley, Fashion Valley, like I've mentioned before. Like, yeah, man, those are those are those are fun areas, man. They really are a lot. You could have a lot of fun over there, bro. Oh man. That's cool, William. That's what's up, bro. Like you're a Texans fan, but see, that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, just because you're on that other team don't mean we have to we can't get along, bro. And and you could diss the Titans all day. It's all good. William says, Terra Santa, a lot of military housing. Yes, sir. A lot of that shit, bro. A lot of that shit. Yes, sir. That's facts, bro. That's facts. We still got 10 minutes to go. We're going to go an hour and a half, you guys. So we got like, what? I don't know. Two hours, at least hour shows. That's cool. Yeah, man. There's a lot of, uh, it's crazy. It's crazy to think. Um, San Diego is beautiful, man. It really is. I recommend it to everybody that, uh, Everybody should check it out. For real. Hey, hit one more like. One more like away from 30, bro. We need to start getting these fucking likes up. For real. Whether you like me or not, man. Let's start hitting that like button. Let's start hitting that like button. William said, exactly, bro. I could talk sports all day. And it's been my favorite sport since I was a kid. Yeah, man. It's 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 just it is it's just fun, bro. It's just fun. It, it, it really is. There's nothing like it, man. There's nothing like it. Uh, Texan says uh, the Jags have no weapons and the Colts have an old quarterback. <sighs> Texans fan for life, dude. 
how do they have an old quarterback? The dude's like 21 years old. <laughs> He's like 21 or 22 years old, bro. Like, what are we doing here? William says, I love all the old school NFL stuff too. Yeah, me too. Like, I love the history, you know what I'm saying? But like, I grew up, I was, I grew up in the 90s. So as a kid, you know, that was my, you know what I'm saying? I got to see all that shit. Very happy I was able to see it too. What's up, Larry? How you doing, bro? Big dog, everybody hit that fucking like button, comment, and subscribe. You guys, let's go. Remember, we do have Cash App, Money Sign Titan Anderson, and we do have Super Chat if anybody wants to do the donation gimmick thing. This is our second live stream of the day, fellas. Second live stream of the day. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> pretty fucking crazy. Yes, sir. We got a few more minutes, man. We got about five more minutes. Appreciate everybody again, man. I appreciate everybody again. William says, I'm, I think I'm the only one who saw two NFL teams relocate in my life. Oilers and Chargers. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, the Chargers, me being in San Diego and you too. Uh, yeah, that was weird, man. That was weird. I, I, I was so happy. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I was so happy that they left, man, just to kind of just troll the fucking San Diegans and shit. But um, it is weird not seeing, you know, not even a, I mean, you, you don't see really any Charger stuff anywhere. Like, I'm going to be honest. It's, you, you really don't. Kind of, kind of sad to be honest, but. It is what it is. Anyway, you guys, we're going to close this shit down, man. I want to thank everybody for coming in. We had a crazy ass show. We had Billy Scott on for the first part. Uh, you know, we talked for a little bit after. Uh, hopefully you guys continue to enjoy the shows and everything like that, man. Continue to support the channel. Again, a like goes a long way, bro. A like goes a long fucking way. So thank you guys so much, man. I want to, I just want to thank you guys. And um, remember, there might be another show later. We'll see. Anyways, you guys, tighten up Code Blue Cyclops swag. You can't spell Titans without putting that T-A in it. I love y'all, man. Tighten up. Let's go, baby. Tennessee Titans football. Tennessee Titans football, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go, Titans. Let's go, Titans. Fuck the haters. We don't like the damn Colts. We don't like the Texans. We definitely don't like the Jacksonville Jungle Cats. You guys are trash. We're going to win the division this year. Everybody buckle up, tighten up, and get ready for an explosion. I am ready for this year. I want to watch my team back in the playoffs. Willie Rocket throwing the ball deep to Calvin Ridley. Touchdown. Willie Rocket to D-Hop. Touchdown to Chig. Touchdown to Josh Wiley. Touchdown to Ty J. Spears. Touchdown to Tony Pollard. Touchdown to NWI. Touchdown to, to Malik Neighbors. Touchdown. We want more touchdowns. We need to score 30 points. We need to start getting this going, bro. We need to start scoring more points. Help the defense out. Stop putting the defense out there for all these long-ass drives, and then they're just tired the whole damn game, getting shitted on no diaper. We need to fix it. And I think we are a lot closer to being AFC South champions than you all may believe. Again, I'm Titan Anderson, and you can't spell Titans without putting that T-A in it. I'm him. Ah.